Hey everyone, welcome to Tuesday with Pastor Dan. I do apologize for last week not getting a video out, but I uh, hope you all will grant me some grace for for that. Uh, being it was, uh, it's been a it's been a tough couple of weeks. Lots of uh, lots of just stuff going on, um, visits and appointments, and uh, yeah, just to, um, Pastor Bethany said that everything just kind of feels heavy right now, and, and that's true. It does. It does feel a little heavy. Uh, around here with um, news and finding out about people and what's going on in their lives and, and some people going through some stuff and us going through some stuff and it's just it's hard and um, and I think I just want to be honest about that that it's it's hard and I think one of the things that I've gotten on my soapbox before as you can call it soapbox is that yeah, you know people People are presented with the idea that when they become people of faith, that uh, it's it's just it's just easier, right? Like God is some sort of infinite vending machine that uh, that you just tap the button for easy peasy, and and, and there it is. And that's uh, that's a nine, by the way, on the vending machine is is easy life, um, except for a nine is always out. You, know, you come to those vending machines where there's nothing in them, um, and. and it doesn't just get easier, and I think, I think, part of the powerful realization that it's just not going to be easy uh, now that we have faith is it, it, a powerful thing because then we can relinquish some uh, semblance of trying to control and trying to step outside of 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 our little circles of of what we can and can't do. Um, and which brings me to kind of what I've been thinking about is that um, we're doing a we do a prayer night with the youth. I can't remember what it is, but uh, that's what it is this week. And it is the difference between being and doing. Um, and when we think it was supposed to be easy, or we or we we get frustrated frustrated and anxious, we we try to overcompensate with our doing. Um, uh, we try to overcompensate with our controlling or manipulating or well, we got to do this this and this and we you know there's this this set of things that has to be done and then we step outside of our realm of what we actually should be doing into what other people are doing and we get out of our lane and then we get even more anxious because now more things aren't working um and the difference is is that sometimes we should simply be and i know it's very very difficult because i'm not really wanting to just be and some of the tougher times, and uh, but sometimes we just need to be, and I think that's be in light of who God is. I think that's be in light of who we are in God. It's just, just uh, it's not just about existing, kind of nebulously floating, but but being is is, is a presence, is 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 actively engaged. But we're not trying to over function. And when we over function, we 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 over anxiety we we struggle we 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 uh life gets very hard because we're trying to do more than we can and so sometimes we just have to be we just have to be present and we just have to be in it or around it whatever it happens to be um and that's the good and the bad uh we don't often celebrate victories very well we just okay that was a thing and we move on whether it's a big or little one um, and we don't do well to sit in, in, in the struggle um, that is somewhat found in life or a lot found in life. We, we try to force our way through it and, and, and just make it better for ourselves or for anyone else. So I want you all to think about, is this a time to be or to do? Um, is this a time for me to be in the moment and just be present with God and with what is what is transpiring? Or is this a moment for for maybe a, a stronger action. May you all be blessed this week. Look forward to seeing you soon.